All right, so we are here playing some more FTB Skies Expert. And I just wanted to pop in here right quick. This guy just spawned. I was fixing to start recording. And I wanted to show you all how I've been getting the stuff from these bees. Uh, and that is how. Uh, I catch them with a lead. I bring them down here underground. And then I try to keep them in a corner to where the stuff won't run away from me. Uh, and the reason why I wanted to do this right quick, I got hard and integral component which not that we need it for anything right now but yeah that's that's how i've been dealing with our bees anyways welcome back how are you guys doing today hope you are doing well i am so uh last episode we got uh through uh, our spirit stuff we got all of that going on i need some food we got that going uh, we got cobblestone generator, we got our first bit of power, we're ready to move on with our business today, and our business today is going to be trying to get, uh, gold, which, I was just kind of looking around here, uh, to get gold, we need gold shards, and to get gold shards, we need primitive slurry, and primitive slurry is easy enough for us to get, just mixer and gravel, but it has to be heated. We got the blaze burner, so yeah, we've got all of that. Um, so two shards. Lovely. That's what I needed to know. So but that's what we're going to work on today. Uh, and in order for us to get our blaze burner, we can do this one of two ways. Uh, we can use coal or wood. Or we can use... Did we get the straw from a quest? I don't remember if we did or not. Um, no. But we do get it from a quest when we get the vegetable oil. And the vegetable oil is easy enough to make. But we need to make us a mechanical press. We're going to need a couple of... Well, not a couple of these. But we're going to need to make this anyways. So, we need um, another andesite casing. We're going to need a shaft. We're going to need a, another bowl. We made a bunch of andesite alloy. I said a bowl. It's not a bowl. It is a basin. We're going to need uh, some wood. And then we will need some shafts. And I think we still got some around here. Beautiful. Uh, smooth stone. That is something that we do not have. So let's get that crafted. Alright, there we go. We got everything that we need. Slabs. Mechanical press. Lovely. That is not a quest. And this actually, yeah, we're going to have to change that up. I need I don't know if I've still got it floating around here. No. Alright, so I'm going to need to make some more shafts. We're going to need to make a... I forget what the thing is called now. This guy right here, gearbox. Uh, so we're going to need a few things for this. Mostly some wood. Alright, so we should have everything we need now in order to do this. Gearbox. We want to change that into a vertical gearbox. And that is not where I wanted that to go. That's where I wanted it to go. And then we can place our mechanical press there. Our basin can go right there. And it is now ready to go. We can do what we need to do, which is to get a whole bunch of seeds... 
which we've got. And for the vegetable oil, or the plant oil, well, it's vegetable oil. Uh, seeds gives us 25. So, f wait, God, that's a lot. Um, that's four for 100. We need 40 for a bucket. Uh, I don't need the water right this minute. So let's throw those guys in there, and I missed. There we go. And then I need to get my... crank we can put it that didn't work at all and that give us yeah 0.25 this is going to take a minute all right we're almost there I had to throw two more in there because I can't count. And that should be one bucket of vegetable oil. That's not what I wanted to do. Beautiful. There we go. That is done. That gives us a overgrowth seed and a straw. I know all about straws. We've used them before. Now then we've got, after that, we've got ethanol. Um, which we can't do yet because we are not spawning spiders in our mob farm. And then uh, from there we get into the biodiesel. The biodiesel needs the ethanol and the vegetable oil to make the biodiesel. And then, yeah, we get into some Ars Nouveau, which we can't do yet. But we've got the plan on. So the next bit of business, before we can get into making our gold actually it's not but quest wise we need to make the crystallized amber oh wait we need the gold to do that so the crystallized or to get the gold we need to get the primitive slurry which we looked at it's the mixer and we need so let's get down underneath here I need some blocks to place stuff on here. That'll work. And that'll work. Beautiful. So there is our blaze burner. Like I said, we can give this guy um, coal and wood. Uh, we're going to save our plant oil or vegetable oil for later we've got plenty of coal for the moment so we're just going to use it uh and then i need gravel and i don't have any gravel right this minute um so we need a half a bucket and the four gravel gives us a full bucket i'm going to need another bucket uh, I'm pretty sure I've got one. I do. And then I need four gravel, which we can get right quick. Uh, no, right quick is not. Oh, yeah, it is. We do still have our hammer. Really? Really? I suck at throwing stuff in these basins. What? 
There we go. All right. And then we just need to give it some of that. Hopefully that will be long enough. And we've got our slurry. Beautiful. And from there, we need two redstone to make two gold shards. Since we've got a bucket's worth of it, we're going to go ahead and do two recipes of this. And I just got to find the redstone. And I believe this is our... Wait, is it... Super cool. That is it. So let's give it our slurry. And let's give it our redstone. That is using up a ton of power. But we do have that quest now complete. That gives us four gold. And we're going to need a bunch of gold to be able to get through all of this. So, if we come in here, we've got plant oil taken care of, we've got primitive slurry, and we got to our gold. Lovely. We're done with our checklist for now. We can put that up. Uh, next on our business is going to be to get the crystallized amber. Um, we need some of the lava that we've been doing. Um, we only need... I put the lava in here. Wait, I can do that now. I have lava in this guy. That didn't work. Um, why is it? Bucket mode, no. I need to fix that if I can. Alright, I found the hotkey for it. And that's still not working. Oh, that, that worked. Uh, and it's still not doing what I want it to do. Wait, can I? Oh, that's not what I wanted to do. Let's do this. Let's set this empty and that will not automatically output all right we're going to do it the hard way and i'm probably going to wind up wait a minute well that explains a lot and i've lost a bucket of lava so that sucks That's what I was wanting it to do. All right, so first things first is for this, we're going to need one of our gold ingots, and then we need a fire charge, which is gunpowder, coal, and we've got coal on us. I should have gunpowder and blaze powder. We got a blaze powder. Oh, by the way, I have this guy here. I didn't show him. Uh, fisherman. Uh, we have easy villagers in this. This guy spawned, and I picked him up. Gunpowder. So there is our fire charge, fire charge part to this. And the only other thing we need now is to get our fire coral and to do that I've got to sift some more it's got to be string mesh so that means I got to find my string mesh uh, and then sift some dirt so let me get to sifting I'll be back all right well I had to sift through entirely too much of this oh no um, all right I got it back uh, sift enti through entirely too much of this to get what I needed. So, but we've got everything. We should have what we need. Uh, Power-wise, we should be good. So, we need a fire charge, this guy, and our gold ingot. And 
and we've got our crystallized amber. Lovely. We can get our tank, get that back, and we can complete our quest, which gives us a heart container. Awesome. All right, so next up on our list is the Experience Obelisk. We need to get into Obsidian for that. Uh, but really what we need is Archwood Saplings. And to do that, we need to get into some Botania Petals, which we've got. Jungle Sapling any sapling, and blue dye, which we can do, but the cognitum, we get that from the biomass and making the blood sigil. So I got to make another blood sigil. We did not get the cognitum from that before. So the liquid biomass, kelp biomass, let's get all of this stuff going. I still got biomass, seagrass. All this stuff can go up. I really need to get some inventory sorting going. Uh, this is getting ridiculous. Uh, our lava we don't need right now. That we don't need. Uh, food. That'll work for the moment, and I need six pieces of kelp, and I believe that goes in there. Yeah. Four should be enough for now. So one bucket, all of our buckets are got stuff in it for the moment. Um, do we have anything in here at all? We do have lava in there, which means I need my lava. Let's see if I can get this out. And there's still some in it. Um, it's not getting all of it out. We'll do it that way then. Lava's all out. Blood sigil's now in it. And then we just need to get, we don't need that. We need two biomass buckets for this. Four black stone, four red stone. That's supposed to be polished, I do believe. Um, four, four, yeah, that should be everything we need. And this should give us the cognitum. Beautiful. We got that. So, whichever one I make, we're going to get all four of them anyway, so it doesn't matter which one we do make. So, this one will probably be the easiest one. I, like I said, I do... We've got petals. Um, I have gotten a bunch of Mystical cyan. Let's hope the cyan petals work. We need a sapling, which I've got. I don't want to use those saplings. There we go. And then blue dye. Beautiful. All right. 
So this gets made inside of the super cooler. 400 ticks. Cognitum, blue, sapling, a petal. And we should have enough power for this. It's going to be close. We run out of power. I've got Pete. Oh, don't tell me that. So it's got to be full of power in order for it to work. Well, let's get some power going. All right, so right quick, while we're waiting on that to be done, we are going to make us a piece of obsidian. And that's sad because all we're going to do is one piece for now. Because uh, it's all the lava that I still have. But we got our... Soul Steel Pickaxe last episode. That will get us... Obsidian. So there we go. Uh, that's got a quest complete. That gives us eight more obsidian. And now that we've got that, I can look at getting our experience obelisk done. That was the one thing that I hadn't got yet. So for the fluid tank, we need copper plates, which means we just need to smack some copper, which we've got... This guy, uh, we have a depot over here. Two copper ingots. And oh, wait, we've uh, what am I doing? We've got all this down here. And I can just move this guy real quick and get our copper plates. There we go. There's one. And there's two. And what was it we needed for that? Just a barrel. We've got that covered. And planks I've got. Will it let me use? It will. Awesome. All right. So uh, I need this guy, this guy. Let's put that there. Uh, I am going to have to make the iron plates right quick. So let's go ahead and get the fluid tank done. We've got that. We've got the obsidian. All I need now is the iron plates. And I've got a whole bunch of iron somewhere right there. So I need six of these. And I'm going to get these done. Alright, so we should have everything we need now to do the experience obelisk. There we go. There is that guy done. Uh, I'm not even sure where we even could place him. But uh, let's store all of it. We don't need it right now. Uh, and that quest is done. And that brings us to the Archwood Sapling. And before we can do that, we need to make the Worn Notebook. And the Worn Notebook, there's one in the Kashuk Tomb. So that should have us opened up now to our Archwood Sapling. Um, 
Grant's mana generation. We'll save that. All right. Um, Archwood Sapling. We should have enough power in this thing now. Uh, our Sapling, our Mystical Pep pedal and that guy and beautiful we got archwood sapling and that's going to give us like i said all four of them so now that we've got that, we are ready to look into getting into our Ars Nouveau. That's no other quest complete. Uh, so, yeah, that's where we're going to leave this. Uh, we're going to have to get some more gold. But like I said, it's going to take a lot of gold to make our way through this. Uh, we get into... All the different things, uh, they all take gold in order to make. We got to get into creating some source. So, yeah, that's kind of where we're going to be at. Um, it's, and that gets us to where we can start getting into our bigger resource production. So, but with that, that's where we're going to leave it. Uh, Squish, what was that? Uh, oh, we've got a slime somewhere. Where you at, little buddy? I'll take it. So with that, hope you guys enjoyed the episode. I thank you for watching, and I will see you guys next time. Bye!